shopping, go to Sam's Club, all of that. So I figured we would record today, see what all we get into. We're gonna go up and go to Target. We've not been to Target in a while, and we don't have one here close. It's like an hour away. So Lily's been wanting to go there for a while. I've been wanting to go there for a while. So we're gonna go up and just explore a little bit, go a couple places, figured we'd bring you along with us. Never up, never down, never Like a theme in a song, clever Feeling high, feeling low at the same time Feel so right, then I'm wrong, hoping I'll be fine But I get up, I always do I never think, I always do Never thought I wouldn't jump, oh what a fool Get up again Cozy. I have to use the restroom. These look so tiny. That's cute, isn't it? Well, the bigger ones are back here, Boosty. Yeah, I like that. I like that. This color? I mean, I got this one, which is very tiny. And also from back in the day. Mm, I don't know. Maybe this one, the purple. Like have you seen anything plain that you enjoy that no. might want to buy? Target usually never has any of that. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. pretty too. I like both of them. This that one? one? Y'all had this one. I know. Still. That's why that one was I like the hot. Yeah, they, they weren't this soft when you all. But we had a ton of these, and then you all quit one. playing with them. We had that we one had too. We had that one too. Let's see them. I don't know if we, we I think we give them to Leah, didn't we? Yeah, we only yeah. have the dolls. Yeah, yeah and they were cute. I like the cows. They were like yeah, calico I critters. Oh. I see something Hello Kitty right there. I don't know what it is. Many figures. More Hello Kitty right there. What is it? The eggs. What is it? It's the Easter stuff though, cut. ain't it? Yeah. Yeah, what's in here? Oh, candy cane. Candy cane? I don't know what that's called. Oh, them candy. little lollipops? What's in there? Candy cane. Yeah, she's pretty. She got pretty clothes on too, don't she? Y'all yeah. don't play with nothing no more though. Y'all yeah, grewed up on me too much. This is not pretty, in it? It's in one thing. Ew. This might be good, mainly. I like cranberry flavored stuff. Hey. Speaking of cranberry stuff, I okay. So is that one of the carnival ones? Yeah. Huh? It is? Yeah. He's cute, right? Yeah. Wendy got another one of those, which I owe her one. What did you do with your other one? Uh, I just put it under my bed with my other stuff. She know. has one, and it smells like popcorn, and it, was, it gave her headaches, so I thought I would replace it. This thing over here went on a little shopping spree, though, didn't you, Sissy? You get a bunch of cute stuff. You show it when we get home. Winning the Super Bowl. Clear up. Trying to fly because I'm light as a feather. 
Buy 88, but for that price, I could though. No, what? Yeah. Even Walmart, I think 80% is like five dollars a pound or almost. We'll get it anyway. Definitely. Whenever you're down. Stories untold. Come take my hand and walk there with me. I know a place where we can be free. There is a light shining for you, guiding your way, helping you through when shadows and gloom. Obviously, I don't know why I always say that. Obviously, we're home. Um, but I'm going to show you everything that we got from Sam's Club. And then we're going to show you everything that we grabbed at Target. We didn't get much at Target, but figured we'd show you anyways. Um, we don't go to Target much. Like I've said already, we just go up there a couple of times a year. Um, and we only went today because Lily had been wanting to forever, which she scored pretty good on some stuff. So, not necessarily what she went for because I think she was wanting to look at... Um, they used to have sweaters that matched the human and their dog. She wanted those. And then they supposed to have some Hello Kitty stuff up there. We didn't really get much. Didn't see much of that kind of stuff. But we're going to share what we got. We're going to share Sam's Club first. And if I can remember, I will include prices. Um, but we're going to jump in here and I'm going to show you everything that we picked up. Yes. All right. So I've got it all like messed up because people brought it in and put it on the table for me. So... It is what it is. Um, John got this huge Angus beef here. He is going to... This was $3.78 a pound. So, it ended up being a really good deal for him to do this. It's more work, but it's much cheaper. So, he got that. And then we did get a thing of hamburger meat here. It was... It says $4.99 a pound. Is that what we gave for it? I think that's what we gave for it. Um, seems like it was cheaper than that. Anyways, but we got this. It's 88%. Y'all know I usually prefer um, at least 90%, but this is much cheaper, so we will, we're good with it. So we got that. I got a bag of Brussels sprouts and then crescent rolls because y'all know the struggle I have been having with finding these. So I went ahead and grabbed one of these. Grabbed this. I picked up a four pack at Target. For nine dollars, I got this six pack at Sam's Club for like eleven. 
so it's whatever. The ones I got at Target was the taco ones. So I'll be set on these for a while. I really like these, and especially if I'm trying to, um, I don't know, we'll have to check their seat. Especially if I'm trying to hit my protein goals. I really enjoy having that. We grabbed some of this apple juice because the kiddos and John really enjoy juice. So we got that. It's in my purse, baby, right there in the very top. And then we already had this in the cart because me and Lily seen it and liked, you know, thought we would like it. Ended up they had this on sample and we tried it and it was really good. So um, I think the worker said that it is sweetened with stevia. It does have some sugar in it, but um, it was really good. So we grabbed one of those. Hopefully I can control the children and myself and we you know we take our time with these we grabbed some of the big crescent rolls there we've been buying the mini ones at walmart but i think this is actually a better deal and they're bigger so we grabbed those if we have to we will freeze some of these we'll just go ahead and go with it wendy picked up this pretty pink purple pink pink purple looking shirt it is really pretty it's just a hoodie um you know, she loves hoodies and leggings. So she picked up this pink one. And then I picked up these leggings for myself. They have like the mesh detail to them. So they was $9 and something like $10. And then this was on sale for $10. That's just like rounding up. You know what I mean? And then they had chicken legs and chicken thighs on sale for 98 cents a pound. So we grabbed one thing of chicken thighs and one thing of chicken legs. I don't like this chicken i only like chicken breast but the family does and this was a good deal so we went ahead and grabbed that i saw this this is one of jonathan's favorite things to get like at chinese or like certain places so i figured we would get this and we'll let the girls try it. i think they'll like it i really like it as well but if not jonathan will definitely enjoy that we got a 45 count thing of applesauce and then back here was another sample they had and it was just the fruit snacks we grabbed one of those a six pack here of chicken broth. I was wanting to stock up this in the pantry. So this worked out really good for that. Got six cans of tomatoes, eight, I mean, eight cans of tomatoes, eight cans of green beans. I also should have got peas and carrot, no, peas and corn. And I didn't do that. And I regretted it like instantly as soon as we was walking out that I didn't do that. So I got online and ordered the corn because they ship it for free, so why not? Um, but they didn't have peas online, so it is fine. I just wanted like stock up for the pantry. We got those anyways, and then we got a three thing of spaghetti sauce. Got some of these southern style chicken bites, and then the southern style chicken sandwiches. So this will be like Chick Fil A, is what I'm assuming. So I'm sitting here editing this video, and I did want to include here about those chicken sandwiches. Um, Jonathan didn't go with us; he was out with some friends afterwards. Um, I asked him if he's hungry and of course the answer was yes because the answer is almost always yes and I made him one of those chicken sandwiches after he ate it um, he was talking to me and he said where did you go today because I don't know if he realized it was Sunday or what and he's just like he was confused and I said we went to Sam's Club and he's and I said that sandwich come from Sam's Club because I knew what he was talking about um, and he said oh he said it tastes like Chick-fil-a so they definitely taste like Chick-fil-a I did before I took him his sandwich, I took a little piece of the chicken. You can do what you want when you want to make the food, okay? Um, and it did taste really good. So, I just wanted to throw that out there that Jonathan actually thought it was from Chick-fil-A because he wasn't with us. He didn't know um, where we was at. He said he knew what that we had went up north. Um, we have the family, I mean, the Life 360 where we can track each other. So, he knew that we was up north, but he didn't know where we had went and I, it was Sunday so Chick-fil-A the Lord's Chicken was at rest but yeah I just wanted to throw that out there that if you're on the fence about those highly recommend I haven't even got to eat one yet and I still recommend because he approved so I know I'm gonna approve okay back to the video sure, and just what it looks like a friend told me now one of you told me to try the chicken patties I don't know if it's these that you're talking about or if it was actually chicken patties. I looked for just a bag of chicken patties and I didn't see them. I could have overlooked them or my store could have just been out of them. So let me know if you're watching this, if this is what you was talking about or if it was something else. Um, because if it's something else, I'll be looking for them. But I'm excited to try these because I love Chick-fil-A. We don't go often because we got a couple kids that they don't think it's great. 
they love McDonald's with adult children. So I'm gonna get this up really quick because we have a little bit of a, a venture to get to Sam's Club. I'm gonna get this put up and then I'll show you what little bit we got from Target. Okay, that took much longer than expected. Um, that's because I went ahead and just put stuff away where it belongs in the pantry. I still have to do the chicken and the hamburger because I don't have room for that in the refrigerator. So I'm gonna go ahead and prep that and get it in uh, like, like portions of what we will use at a time. And then John's gonna do that big old steak thing. It's actually not a steak, but I told him that I was not, was not going to do it because I can barely get the thicker ones that we buy that you just cut into half and then cut into half again. I can barely get those cut apart. So I'm definitely not going to try to do that big old chunk of meat. So John's gonna do that. I did put that in the refrigerator, but the chickens, chicken, the chicken, I can't, I don't have room for in the refrigerator and the hamburger. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get that over with. But we're gonna share with you really quickly the Target haul, which is pretty much Lily shopping haul. Um, I do want to say, just in case, because there's always, not always, sometimes there's that one person that comes in and they're like, okay. Um, it doesn't happen off. Clear that up, okay? Most of this is for Lily. We went through the women's clothes twice looking for something for Wendy because Nolan could care less about clothes. Like, he don't care. Um, Jonathan wasn't with us. Again, he's the same way, though. He just, he wants his Adidas pants and his van shoes and a black hoodie, and he is good to go. Um, but Miss Lily is, she likes a lot of things. But she can, she loves lots of clothes. So she found quite a bit of stuff. She got two dresses, three shirts. Wendy didn't find nothing at Sam's Club. Wendy did find a hoodie, but um, just in case people think that, you know, we just took Lily on a shopping spree and the rest of the kids was left out. No, it just, that's how it works out sometimes, just in case you didn't know. Um, but we're gonna share you everything that we got here really quick and then I gotta get that meat put away. Okay, so I did find this Good and Gather Cranberry Citrus Sparkling Water. I thought that sounded good sounded. I thought that would be good. I really like cranberry flavored stuff, so I got myself one of those. This was a splurge, not a splurge, what's the word? Spur of the moment purchase. It was, I mean, it's unfinished, I even think. I can't talk. But it was five dollars and I thought that's cute. I could probably do something with that. So she came home with me. So I got that. I did pick up these three Easter eggs. This one has um bunny a bunny in it that you build with like cheap Legos. This one has a dog and then this one has a dinosaur. Figured those would be good for our family Easter egg hunt. So we got those. This is the chips I was talking about. It's not it wasn't as big of a ripoff as I thought it was. This was $9 for four bags, and the other was 11 for t six bags. So, you know, it still was cheaper the other way, but not that big of a deal, and then I didn't have this flavor, so that is fine. And then on to the Lily stuff. Wendy did get that QT toe that I showed when we was at Target. She ran off with it, of course, but I got Lily to bring back her clothes. Wendy ended up actually finding this for Lily the second time we was over trying to find Wendy something. Um, we just walked right past it and she said, there's a dress back there with Hello Kitty. And so we turned around and went back and looked at it. So Lily got this and she was so excited. She loves Hello Kitty. Um, this was $22, a little expensive in my opinion for what it is, but she hopefully will get to wear this for a very long time. So it, it works out. And she is at the age where she really takes care of her stuff. Lily has always been the one that takes care of like her clothes and shoes. Um, Wendy's getting there, but Lily, hopefully she'll get to wear this for a very long time. And then we did get this. She loves these two-toned shirts. This one looks like lemonade. Um, she got that. We grabbed this just because it was on sale for $7. It is cropped. Lily likes crop stuff and I let her wear it to a point. You know, she can have just a little bit, a little sliver of her stomach showing. And I think that is fine. You do you, whatever, mind your own business. Um, but we got this. It was on sale for $7, and it just totally fits her style, I guess. So, this, she also got this. This was $8, so that was really good. That was not on sale or anything. Um, this and the pink and this dress came from the kids section, the Hello Kitty dress, and then this was from adults. But she picked out this as well. She really likes the ribbed stuff, in case you couldn't tell. And then she really liked, ignore that 
mess. That's the kids craft stuff that I'm not put away. Um, she really liked this one. They had a bunch of different options. I actually was thinking afterwards that we should have, they had a pink one with butterflies on it that she really liked too. Um, but she picked this one. She liked this one better. And I wish I would have suggested that she got the one with butterflies for Easter. Cause I think that would have been pretty and totally her style, but I didn't, but it's fine. So she picked out this one. This one was $20. Kids are expensive. So that is everything we got. Nothing exciting or anything. Not to me anyways, but obviously Lily thinks so. And Wendy liked her QT toe. But with that, I think we're going to close out this video here so I can get this meat put away. I hope that you enjoyed just going and hanging out with us at Sam's Club and Target. Um, if you are not part of our family and you enjoy this, make sure you subscribe down below. We do quite a bit of shopping videos. It's just something I enjoy doing. And yeah, we probably won't have a actual Walmart haul this week because of this. Because I, like I said a few days ago in videos, um, I'm not going to like stock up just so I can stop shopping. That is not what I intend to do. I want to get the pantry stocked and then um, we will, we'll still shop. That's what I'm trying to say. It's just, it's confusing. I know what I'm trying to say, but I don't know how to say it. Like we will still use the food we've got in the pantry, but I fully intend to keep it as it is, if that makes sense. So yeah, this is not a stock up so we can go cheap, which we're really bad at doing the cheap thing, but this is just a stock up so that we have food security. Okay, that's, Tamara said that word. And then in my comments the other day, somebody said something about food insecurity. And it just works perfect. This is so that we have food security. If the world gets crazy, er, if the world gets crazy, er, y'all know it's crazy right now. Or if just something happens and we can't get to the grocery store or something happens, you know, John can't work, God forbid, for some reason for a while, we have food and that is a worry that we won't have to worry about if something else happens for us to worry about. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to get off here and go get this meat prepped up and get it into the deep freeze. Thank you guys so much for all of your support. And if you haven't already, like I said, make sure you join our family down below. Oh, you see my shirt? Came from my friend Jenny. So as always, remember to show grace, be content, and live blessed. Until next time. Bye guys. Bye.